do a fat mute all. And let's change the title. Let's do some APGP. <laughs> he just fed my laner, by the way. That guy just fed my laner. What's up, Brando? We're gonna pause the music. We're gonna go serious mode, chat. We're gonna go absolutely insane serious mode. Alright, so they have Bastard Amumu, Bastard Callista, Bastard Diana. What does that mean? And Bastard Silas. That's four melee characters, basically. So I press Alt, and they're crippled. Right? I don't know if I'm going to go Leandries this game. Leandries is good versus their support and jungler, but, but it would one-shot their... Soul. I need to go Dark Harvest. Usually I go Dark Harvest with APGP, but it's okay. Well... Wait for Q, S key, S key, S key, Q. Man, that guy's mad. Damn, he started Dark Seal. And he has Domination, so that's a little messed up, actually. Oh, okay. He just ignored all the minions. Fucked up, but it's okay. I don't have t uh, time more tonic, unfortunately. I'll take back what's mine. He's gonna hit level two in like one minion, I think. This guy thinks he's the shit. Well, goodbye, Nyla. Hey, We're gonna murder this guy soon. Or At least got his ignite out. Surely Diana doesn't cue me over the wall. That would just be way too ridiculous. No! Oh! <laughs> Baby! That is good. I like that. Hey. That feels good. That 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 does feel good. I will not lie to you. Just gonna ignore that jungler. Fuck that guy. Hello, Mr. Celery Juice. Oh, shit. We just ignore that guy screaming for his life. Oh, he's got his tear of the goddess Do I now. Let's look go. Like a patient man. Perhaps we put a war just in case Celery Juice tries to gank us again. Another and here we are living in our humble abode. Oh. Now Silas does have. Oh. Yeah, spit me oh. out. Silas does have a little bit of damage. He's a bit stinky. Well, Hecarim needs to be careful. That guy tried to take the cannon, but unfortunately, he's not a good player, so he does not get the cannon. Better luck next time, Mr. Hecarim. <laughs> oh shit, goodbye, cruel world. Unfortunately, uh, Silas has murdered me. 
So how do we combat this? You might be asking. We go coal, and then we buy. We don't buy anything. We just walk back mid lane. <laughs> no war cages. Oh my gosh! Wait, if we gank bot lane and we flip a random ass gank, maybe they die. Good man. Yes, sir. Nothing like flipping a random gank. Now we get hit by the Amumu Q, maybe? Maybe not. Oh my gosh, we missed the cannon. But we're not done here yet. You see, the bot wave is fucked as is, so we're just gonna leave it like that. As a matter of fact. Bastard celery juice. Yo, kill that guy. We're gonna kill this bastard celery juice over here. Look at this guy. Bozo. And now we're gonna press the recall button. Get comfortable in my absence. And now bot lane has a freeze. I'm gonna buy another long sword because I'm behind. So I don't think I'll actually one shot the wave once I hit level seven. How is the matchup looking so different from last game? Well, unfortunately, my friend, if you're not able to see how the this late this game is different from last game, I'm afraid there's no hope for you, my friend. So it's not even worth explaining. Because even you will notice it. Toss them to the sharks. Excellent, we now have our Gangplank Ultimate. Now with this Gangplank Ultimate, surely we are to kill the enemy team. Celery juice will fall. Hang them from the rocks. Another! Oh lord, you missed the minion. Faster celery juice. Slow death will be their reward. Come. Well, Bolton is getting ganked. But I know better than to just let them die. And that is precisely why they die here. Never trust a Unfortunately, Stylus has ran away. He gets to escape. He lives to see another day. We now have three Ultimate Hunter stacks. A turned back deserves a knife. More powder. This is Percy and Bilgewater. Let's see. I'm going to pick my recall as well. An elevator. Celery juice is waiting on me. Waiting to swoop in at the right time. But I won't give it to him. I will not give in to Celery juice. Now, I could buy Essence Reaper. But we're playing AP Gangplank, so we don't do any of that weak shit. I can't have it. So what's next, you might be asking? We're just gonna walk to lane. We're gonna walk to lane and we're gonna watch our Hecarim die. Because unfortunately, he has nothing compared to Celery Juice. Hi. 
Now, Silas is missing. Herald my return. So he's most likely roaming. Ah, uh, there he is. There's that good old deviant Silas. And there's that bastard celery juice again. Mercy but have no fear. Alas, I have conquered celery juice. Choke the abyss, scum. Oh. Hecra misses his ult, but Garen outplays him. My ship, not my soul. I see, I see. Now, Diana is missing, so perhaps we'll be able to snatch a plate off the My back of the silence. Yes, now we repo. And just like that, we are able to consume Lich Bane and perhaps even a Dark Harvest stack. Perhaps. Ah, but that bastard Silas, he's waiting on us. He's waiting on us to mess up. So we buy a long sword. Our ulti is up in 82 seconds. Now that we have purchased our Lich Bane, we are now going to... Oh, give me one moment. Words mean nothing. Flesh kills white. <laughs> Hate is a child's word. Just oranges, their blood oranges. A reckoning approaches. More power. Do I look like a patient man? Death spit me out. How they try. All right, I'm back, Jet. I got my ult upgrade, and we're hunting. We now have our ult upgrade available. We have our ult upgrade available. We have seven stacks left on our coal. 
We are ready for anything that this world throws at us. We are going Leandries. We are going Leandries because they do have decent health bars. They have do, do be having decently sized health bars. Betrayal stings like salt on a wound. Celery juice. It's been done. Carve my, name in their skull. my god, the game is winnable. And with that, we have our Dark Seal stacks that are necessary. Seas and men betray. Beautiful. Just like that, we're level 12. Hang them from the slaughter. Leandries is now purchased. Ulti is up in 30 seconds. TP going down bot lane. Silas noticed that Herald. And we march forward. Glory awaits no AP Gangplank. Be their reward. Glory awaits. We will need a ward though behind us. Jace has shown himself. Another. Beautiful. The sea has no memory, but I do. Beautiful XP. Getting much closer to that level 13 mark that we so dearly care about. Three stacks on our Dark Seal. Our ulti is available and ready. Never One good ultimate can win us the game. One bad ultimate can lead to problems. Us being the most useful champion, useless champion in the game. More powder. What's next on our journey? You might be asking. I'm thinking about potentially going Axiom Arc as a third item. Now here's the thing: Axiom Arc, the way Axiom Arc works, right? Yeah, it looks like they're playing to leave. I'm not gonna use my GPL again. Now we drop it. Ooh, look at that thing do work. Baby. Now we go back top lane. I am Jace has recently been murdered, so we don't have to worry about Jace Talus. Both is up in 60 seconds. By Jace Talus. Whoa. Now we have our last remaining stack on this Gromp. If we're able to take this Gromp, then we're able to take their LP. Okay, if we're able to take this blue buff, we're able to take their up. Okay, well, if we're able to take... Okay, well, if we can potentially forfeit the game, then we might have a winning chance at winning the next game. 
Beautiful. Beautifully done. Now, the good thing about APGT is you never be in the ne you never need to be in the vicinity to fight. Because your ulti is your entire character. Heavy artillery for the Another tip, if you don't believe in yourself, no one else would. Which is why you build Medjai's. You build the Magi's because you need to be able to find it in you to believe in yourself. Now, Garen gets caught, so no one believes in him. But me? We're doing work out here. We are pushing ourselves to be the best. Now, next thing we're gonna do is we are going to ult this. So, we're gonna buy Oblivion Ore. Actually, we're gonna buy the need this lead large rod. That's what we're gonna do. And then we're gonna ult there. And let's see what happens. 178 gold. Good AoE damage. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I thought about Axiom Mark, but because we're so far behind, maybe we're not gonna do it. Maybe we won't just go Axiom Mark yet. Ooh. Our biggest nightmare. Take back what's mine. Matsuro! Our ulti is up in 30 seconds. Good morning, good morning. Our ulti is now up in 10 seconds. We are prepared for anything that this world throws at us. That, my friends, is why we go AP gameplay. That, my friends, is why we go AP gameplay. Cruelty for all. Absolutely melting the enemy team there. No chance for them of survival. We push one more. More Now we're scaling. Don't get comfortable in my absence. I kind of feel like 180 GP Barrel would have done the same. Well, you're entitled to being wrong. I cannot stop you there.
Do not mind the tanking. Unfortunately, we do no damage without our ultimate ability. The good news is that we still do damage. But it is much harder. Our orange is guaranteed us to always get to full health. I don't mind buying Morellos if they get Dragon Soul. I don't mind needing to adapt. There is never any problem there with that. We will have to take our reset here. Hopefully we do not die. If we can survive this, we can survive anything. We will need to buy anti-heal, however. Oblivion or put us in the perfect spot. I don't mind thinking here. I do not mind this. Oh, perhaps we need to do the Baron. Well, either way, we expedited the process. Now we get another Q, and we run Never towards Baron now. Beautiful. Right. Beautiful. Beautiful process. Someone is really dedicated to FFing? Yes, the losers are. For example, our jungler is a fat loser. That's why, that's why he wants to forfeit. But true Giga Chads like our Nyla, who was 0 and 6, they stick it through. They go all the way to the end. Another. Their tears will salt the ocean. Now we purchase our elixir of sorcery, bringing us to 873 AP. Says the APGP? Yes, the Giga Chad APGP. With many, many weaknesses. If the enemy fails to exploit my weaknesses, that is not my fault. That is the enemy team being shit. Tides of dead herald my return. You cannot fault me for it. Keep playing other players being bad. That's just nonsense. We have 25 stacks on our Magi's. We're gonna need to focus on wave clearing. Gangplank is doing. 
absolutely beautiful work. We burned all of their sums, and we created a giant channel where they can't walk through. Absolutely stellar. Our boots sell for 700. And we will be getting a cosmic drive for 3,000. If we farm our wave efficiently, we should be able to get it. Beautiful. We've unfortunately dropped 50 AP. We could have had 1000 AP if we were able to farm a little bit better. We now have Cosmic Drive, which brings us to a whopping 909 ability power. We will need to run, unfortunately, my friend. Alright, we'll have to push one more wave. Our oranges heal us for 963 health at least currently. It is a child's word. We have 909 AP. Elder Dragon coming up. It's winnable. 900 AP gangplank at the moment. 10 CS per minute in a master GM lobby. Bot wave is a bit fucked, but that's okay. the trigger a little bit too quickly we won't be able to get another gangplank ball rat cocksucker fucking bitch bastard disgusting ape booga booga Gangplank. I can't so ex Welcome back, King. Everyone pays. Ooh. I was looking, there's a chance I maybe could have stolen that. Ooh. That was quite close actually. Let's throw it his Maybe what I could have done there is I sell my Leandries for Night Harvester and I bet the center ult kills in there. Ult is up in 35 seconds. 33. Never. 21 Enemy team has Baron and they'll have Elder Dragon This game is gonna be hard. There is no world where we should win it through Baron through Elder The enemy team is so strong, but maybe one good gangplank bolt 
hate it's all it takes well I got wamboed unfortunately my Morellos has reduced 2.5k but I was CC'd for so long it was a valiant effort GG. It was a nice try. My first strike got me 2.3k damage. Why no Zonias? What would Zonias have done in that last fight? What would Zonias have done there, Poe Reaper? The guy in chat who's saying it. Poe Reaper. Why? What makes you believe that Zonias would have been awesome? Let's look at the damage charts. Let's see the damage charts. The damage charts do not lie. 46k damage. Most damage in the entire game by a landslide. Hmm. Interesting.